Hello and welcome to this week's Sunday show. Now we have a wonderful guest that is going to talk um, today and his name is St John the Baptist. Um, I have a particular soft spot for St John the Baptist um, because he is just absolutely fantastic when he comes through. Anyway, um, so let's, without further ado, let's let's start connecting to, to him and see what he's got to say. But before, oh, actually, before I do, don't forget to subscribe because that way you can, you know, be notified of, of other videos and you've got to ring that little bell as well. Subscribe and ring the bell and then you'll get notified. But anyway, let's get on to St. John the Baptist. Um, he is saying to me that he is very, very glad to be able to come forward today and communicate um, in this way. He's, he's saying that when he was on the earth plane, um, he said that life was sort of very sort of simple. And he's showing me insects um, and he's putting a sort of like an insect in my mouth. And he says that he was resigned to, to, to eating a lot of insects when he was uh, alive. And he said that um, at first, when he started eating insects, he said it was like, oh, I don't really like that. And, it, and he was a bit sort of uh, repelled by it. But after a while, he actually got um, really, really used to it and really liked to... Um, to, to really like to, to eat them um, and he's showing me making fires as well and he would um, cook these insects on the fire um, and uh, and that was and he's telling me that that was sort of you know the basis of, of, of a, a lot of what he ate um, and and he's saying to me that so he sort of he looks at our world today and sort of how we eat and, and, and the food we eat. And he sort of, in a way, he, he says, I, I marvel at sort of, you know, how, you know, wonderful the food can be. And, and he sometimes is very interested in some of the chefs that exist in this world. And he'll go around some of the chefs and see what they're cooking and how they're cooking it. Because he's telling me that he's very interested in food and, and likes to be, um, aware of what's going on with food and he's saying you know it's very easy for him because he can just sort of come into a kitchen wherever the kitchen is in the world and meet with whatever chef it is and he, he just loves it um, and he's he's saying to me that that's not the only thing that he will do just you know for his own amusement sometimes he, oh he's saying to me that he used to enjoy um, he, 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 well, he enjoys staying in some really nice hotels. And so when he, um, so what he will do is he will go to a hotel that has an empty room and he'll stay the night <laughs> in the hotel, um, or wander around and, and enjoy the festivities of what's going on in a, in a hotel. And of course, he'll never miss going into the kitchen because he loves the food. Um, and he's talking about um, a hotel in uh, the, D the Dorchester in, in London. And he's, he's telling me that this is one of his favourites that he will visit and go to. He's also very interested in, in sort of e-commerce, com e he's calling it, e-commerce, which I think means sort of, you know, the, the working with the... Um, computers and, and doing business on the internet. Um, and he says that um, since he's been in the spirit world, he's, he's involved himself a lot with e-commerce and, and looked into e-commerce quite a lot. And, and, and he always looks to sort of help people um, along the way. And he's particularly interested in, in sort of financial matters and, and business and 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 things like that and this is where he feels that since he's been you know as an evolved spirit as he is he feels that he this is his area of expertise sort of you know business and financial matters and it's it's an area that he has always been interested in and he's made it his business to take to treat it as his priority in in life to to always 
look at how he can um, understand um, new areas of business and how to conduct business. But his favourite um, area at the moment is e-commerce. He says that he regularly has meetings with God and, and one of the conversations that they will have is sort of, they will talk about his understanding of, of business matters and they will have quite lengthy conversations about how business can improve our lives and how, how business can, can enhance the way we operate. Um, but he, St John the Baptist is also saying to me that, that he's saying he feels that sometimes business can be a downfall to us and we can be, you know, we, it can make us greedy or, or not sort of consider other people. But he feels that, you know, moving forward, he, he aims to sort of be involved with the business side of charity work and he's going he's he's making a promise to work alongside charities and help them in in their work and and in the, in the business matters and and god has agreed that this will be his job from now on he's telling me that that in time we will be setting up a charity and and he wishes to um, help myself with the charity work that we will be doing. He's also saying to me that he has a love of, of children and, and children are very dear to his heart. And he's, he's saying that in all of his work, he always likes to give extra special care to the children that are in need. Um, and he will be um, looking to to find ways of helping children more as 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 he goes forward in his life. He's talking about his friends in 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 heaven, and and some of his friends, um, he's referring to Jesus and and Mother Mary, um, and and the apostles and and um, Mary Magdalene. He says he's very fond of Mary Magdalene. Um, and he's talking about um, all, all his friends in, in heaven. And he says that they have all said that they, they offered their services to him and said that they will always be willing to help him wherever possible when, when he needs, needs help. He's thanking you for all listening to, to his words um, because he so enjoys coming forward and, and speaking. Um, so, so um, and he's he's just okay he's just stepping back so if you enjoyed the video don't forget to subscribe and and look forward to seeing you next sunday goodbye